less than five. There we are. There is the sound of music. There is nothing that tops the sound of eight quads going around that TBS tower and the thrill that we see when all eight get through without crashing out. There we are, underway. Aerial Link is going to get our full shot, and I'm watching him in that back stitch it up section about to go to the turbo wing. There's uh, one more to go out of TBS. Looks like he's been able to hold off the rest of the field into that turbo wing slurtle section. Now he's going to drop down into second. He seems to be chasing Reaper. Reaper going to be the first one to go up, but Aerial Link right behind him. Look at this battle. Watch it line of sight. Reaper and Aerial Link going through the DRL dive. That fat shark corkscrew. It's going to be yellow, I think, is Reaper, and the other one is Aerial Link. And we are making it happen here on this opening lap. It'll be Reaper versus uh, just ahead of Aerial Link on the opening lap. Uh, 50.1 in a 51.2. You got Rotor Girl right with them, Footer right with them. This is a good heat, heat number seven. So far, our first five across the line, 10 seconds apart. That includes Viking FPV. On that lead lap, there's Waffle FPV crossing over in about the number six spot with a 68.8. Watching the Reaper and Aerial Link show at that Turbo Link Slurtle section. And it is still Reaper just ahead, but not by much. It's going to be a two gate lead. Reaper through our DRL Sim dive gate, Aerial Link right through our DRL. Dive gate, 30 seconds to go, which means we get to watch these guys battle it out a little bit more. And there goes Rotor Girl up to the skies as well, still running in that number three spot. And uh, we're going to catch up. Oh no, I was watching uh, Footer trying to get some go go juice, but uh, he's going to slam into a gate. So breathing room right now for Rotor Girl running in third. Now we're looking at Reaper and Waffle making a move. Waffle is now slid up into second. He lost Aerial Link, so that moves Rotor Girl up into third. Viking FPV moving up to fourth. And the clock about to expire right there, so it'll be a checkered flag the next time they go over our super hurdle and through our start finish gate at the top. Thanks to our presenting partner, the Academy of Model Aeronautics. And still watching. It looks like uh, Footer got through with just a little bit of time to spare, so he is now on lap number three. Clock's showing me two laps in a minute 59.2, so seven tenths of a second to the good for him. And it's Waffle and Reaper with that photo finish right there by three hundredths of a second, four versus six. Holy, they're gonna finish first and second. There's Viking, three laps in two minutes 38. Rotor Girl, three laps in two minutes 39. That is a uh, personal best there for Rotor Girl, three laps 239, 17th overall with a one round effort. You got Viking, three laps, two minutes, 38. That puts him in the number 16 spot on him. Five. Here we go. Pilots, arm your quads. Five on the tone in less than five. Off to the race as we go. Fantastic start here for our field. Watching Jay Nasty come in low side to that Team Black Sheep Tower top left hand corner as your leader. Rotor Girl did quite well here in qualifying, was inside of the top 20, I believe. Trying to stay alive here with this huge field with Aerial Link and NOS MPV as well. Four pilots all trying to stay alive. And what has been a throwdown showdown this Northeast Regional Final. I mean, the course, the crew, the camaraderie, and now the racing. The fruits of our labors playing out here on Championship Sunday afternoon in New Egypt, New Jersey, in the Northeast Region. Here comes your leader, top left, Jay Nasty. On to lap number two, 46.6, the opening lap time. There's the breathing room, but we got a battle for the 2-3 between Rotor Girl and Aerial Link. Aerial Link just ahead of Rotor Girl by two tenths of a second. NOS FPV in fourth. A battle for the 2-3-4 between Aerial Link, Rotor Girl, and NOS FPV onto lap number two. Jay Nasty, as long as he doesn't make any mistakes, he is going to be moving on up, and the rest of them going to slug it out here in race 11. Angel FPV, Fat Kid, Rathburn, Schnur, we're going to you right after this one. Watching your leader, Jay Nasty, going up high to the skies from the DRL Sim up the launch gate to the dive gate. And now to our Fat Shark Corkscrew. 
Now watch your next one to fly to the skies. That's Ariel Link running second. And now it looks like Nos just ahead of Rotor Girl. So switch up in our giddy up. Rotor Girl dropping down to fourth. But that battle for the two, three is now kind of like a battle for the three, four. As we have Jane Nasty on the final lap. Now Ariel Link on that final lap. Five seconds back from our leader. And ahead of that battle for three, four. There's Nos FPV onto the final lap. White flag still flying. And Rotor Girl onto that final lap as well. Great showing for her so far. But Dance Destiny is in her thumb tips right now as we try and push through. The top two in this one stay alive. This is the last lap, full throttle wide open, first or second to continue on the Northeast Regional Championship. Jay Nasty up to the skies to that DRL dive as we look next to Aerial Link to go up to the skies to that DRL sim dive. Big gap. Now let's go up with Nos to that DRL sim dive and let's go up to the skies with Rotor Girl. Pretty good separation here, but this is the final lap. Jay Nasty will stay alive and so will Aerial Link. Three laps, 227 for Aerial Link. And Jay Nasty, three laps, 223. When it's all said and done, Rotor Girl and Nos FPV finishing up third and 